Hey, Chris, there are no hurdles in horse racing. That's not to say, though, the Thistledown hasn't cleared a few in its 90 plus year history, but a new chapter is set to begin on Friday. Beside the North Randall Grandstand that has stood overlooking this track since the 1950s, the future of the newly renamed Jack Thistledown Rises, connected to the Thousand Space parking garage, is an expansion of the gambling floor and several dining options. When the Racino opened three years ago this weekend, there were no guarantees it was staying in North Randall, so additional amenities were few. The $70 million investment changes that. The first couple of years, we just didn't have enough assets to compete in the market. And now, with this new $70 million reinvestment plan, we have more restaurants, we have more slot machines. And covered parking, enabling gamblers to walk right onto the floor. Mill Creek Grill, the new restaurant, also offers customers something unique. Views of both the gambling floor and the track. Our racing season opens up on April 25th, and, and our restaurant here sets right on the apron. So. We're going to have parties during the summer and, and, and a great view uh, with some floor to ceiling windows, uh, view of the racetrack during racing seasons. When you walk in the door, you'll be struck by this a 20 by 60 foot living wall, 7,000 different plants representing 10 different species. The changes give the property something that was lacking, and they're not done. We're already planning on our future phases and, and, and what more operations, more assets for our customers. So we're, it'll continue to grow, continue to expand, and continue to get that Vegas feel. Well, the Hard Rock Roxino continues to be the Ohio leader, bringing in twice as much as Thistledown last month, but the upgrades are expected to help narrow the gap. On your side, live in the newsroom, John Kasich, News Channel 5.